All right, guys, so for this month's top three tips video, we are going to be focusing on veggies because being St. Patrick's Day this month and green things, I figured that would be a fun focus. And veggies are, um, it's something I've always struggled with getting enough of. Like when I found out after learning Portion Fix that I needed to be having at least like four cups a day and that peas and corn and, um, you know, potatoes didn't count, it was like, that was a shocker to me. And so it's always like a work in progress for me, but I wanted to share um, three fun ways that you can actually incorporate veggies into your breakfast, believe it or not. This was something I had not really done much of until maybe recently more so in the last year. Um, the first way is through hiding, hiding them blending spinach into your Shakeology or smoothie that you're having. Um, the boys and I just made some like muffins that could be a breakfast muffin. And if you blend spinach into the wet ingredients, then that's a great way to just sneak some extra nutrients in there. And spinach is a really mild taste, so it doesn't change the flavor much, if at all. Um, and obviously things like adding spinach to, you know, your eggs and things like that, they're not so much hidden that way, but an easy way to incorporate that into your breakfast. Um, the second tip is using things like butternut squash or zucchini um, in the form of like a breakfast hash. So maybe you have some chicken sausage and some sweet potato and maybe a little apple. Um, butternut squash is really nice to add into those flavor profiles. But um, yeah, just that's something that I really have enjoyed doing just to kind of change it up a little bit because I really like having a nice hearty breakfast. Um, so incorporating some veggies into some kind of like breakfast hash or scramble is a really great way, way to start the morning off with some vegetables. And then my third um, tip and probably my most favorite, I was so excited when I discovered this, although I'm sure it was something before I found out about it, um, but peppers, bell peppers are awesome. And what I have done with them, yes, you can like chop them up, put them in an omelet, that kind of thing. But here's a great twist. If you're maybe grain free um, or, you know, want to avoid bread or something or like, you know, avoid having toast, you can take a bell pepper and just cut it in half. And what I've done before is like, I'll cook my eggs up if I do it like over easy or however you like your eggs and just place the eggs right inside that half of the pepper. And I've even like melted cheese on it before, put a little avocado, a little everything but the bagel seasoning on top of that pepper half. And it is so delicious. You get that nice crunch from the pepper and um, obviously like the, the protein from the eggs and whatever other goodies you're putting on there. But it's such a fun way to kind of do a different take on toast, I guess. Um, but get your vegetable in, you know, get a vegetable serving in right at the beginning of the day. So. Anyhow, guys, I hope those are helpful and definitely try out some of those uh, ways for sneaking in some vegetables in your breakfast to start the day off right. All right, guys, I hope you have a great one.